everyone. So we have a new device. It is by Fine Mac called Nobly. It is a long pulse ND YAG and also Alexandrite, 1064, 755. But what's great about this device is it also has the option for a fractional hand piece. We're gonna go into a little bit more detail, but today we're gonna do a hair removal treatment. I wanna talk about the device first. So it does have a cooling system to it. It is a cryo can. It's very easy to get and it sits in the back of the device so it helps with patient comfort. Not only that, but a lot of people want manuals. They want it attached to their actual device. Nobling does it for you. It has great information, details, tips, tricks, everything you want with this device. As you can see, it's very sleek. It's very easy to move around. Also, check that out. Your foot pedal is actually in the front of the device and not the back. So your device will not be tripping over its own cord, okay? So this is what the interface looks like. You have your 1064, 755. Hair removal, pigment lesions, you have a technique, we're gonna go into that, and then also user settings. Once you go in, say for instance, we're gonna do hair removal. This is a very nice interface. You have presets, um, so you can just pick, then you can change your fluence, your pulse duration, how fast your speed, which is your hertz, your spot size can go all the way up to 20 millimeters. And then you have your aiming beam brightness and the RCS is actually your cooling. So you can control your pre and post cooling for the treatment to make it more comfortable. Now this is in a hair removal interface, okay? This device does not need ultrasound gel. The hand piece is really nice, easy to hold. It doesn't interfere. You have this nice long cord so you can actually go over the patient, move around. Um, and this is actually the cooling system right here. This is the spot size. And this is how you change to what spot size you want. As easy as that. So our patient that's gonna get hair removal for the first time, her name is Cassandra. Hi, Cassandra. Hello. So she's very excited. She's been doing waxing, but I can't wait for her to see what hair removal does and how it could change her life. Yes. So with that, we're gonna be doing her underarms. She is a skin type two, so we are gonna use a 755. I went ahead and touched the preset M1, mode one and it actually went to the settings I wanted to treat with. So we're gonna do a test spot, don't need gel, and then we're gonna go from there. There's gonna be some cooling. It's gonna sound like ch, ch and it's gonna be before and after, okay? You're gonna feel like a rubber band snap, but you shouldn't feel any heat. This is gonna be a lot more comfortable than waxing on its own. All right. Okay, you ready? One, two, three. How'd that feel? Oh my gosh, amazing. Right? <laughs> like nothing. Yeah. Wow. The that smell was... of success. Yeah. That's you amazing. smell that? Yeah. That's actually the hair being affected by this. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. I know. Way better than waxing. Right? I'm going to turn it up just a little bit because I want you to get a really good first treatment. Okay? okay. So I'm going to do one more. One, two, three. Great. One more. That just like popped out. Beautiful. Okay, so I'm gonna go pretty quick. You let me know if you need a break. Okay. All right.
So we are using a 20 millimeter spot size. That was actually two hertz, three milliseconds, and eight joules. And that was with the 755 Alexandrite. We had our Amy Bean brightness at a six. Our pre and post cooling was an eight. As you can see, she's very comfortable. She wasn't jumping. How does it feel right now? Cool, it's amazing. Like yeah. nothing. I'm never waxing it yet. <laughs> <laughs> see, told you I will change your life forever. So this device is really fast. Um, you saw the results at a 20 millimeter spot size. Um, you can smell it. You see that singed hair. She has a little bit of follicular edema that is occurring. So this is a great response. Now we're gonna go to the other side and we're done. That doesn't hurt at all. The device is still in the same area when I treated the left side of the client. Now I'm on the right side. I didn't have to move my device and I have plenty of room to do a treatment. So this is really nice, especially if it's a small room and you're able to get around that patient without having to move that device. All right, let's go ahead and do the other side. Ready? How are you doing? Amazing. So to clean this device, all you need to do is you can do 99% alcohol or any alcohol. Usually 70% is my go-to because you can wipe everything down. Um, you have a Q-tip and you just clean the inside. You can even do like ethanol, 99% isopropyl alcohol. This device can do many other indications. So such as pigment, freckles, even it has a whitening, toning, and melasma treating protocol. A lot of people always ask for melasma. Well, this actually has data on how to treat melasma, which is even cooler. So we are going to do another treatment and we, it's super cool. With the fractional hand piece, what we're doing is we're gonna brighten up her skin. She does have melasma. Um, she's got a little bit of redness and her skin is going to brighten up. That pigment is going to lighten up. You don't need numbing cream and I do multiple passes, and all she's gonna feel is warmth. So for the fractional, you can do the 755, you can also do a 1064. To change from using this hand piece and switching to the fractional, what you do is you push in right here, this attachment, twist, put it to the side, grab the end of the fractional, And what you do is you push in, twist, and it's secure. Now you have the fractional, it's ready to go. So we're gonna go into the noble technique. So our main focus is to really help with the melasma, brighten up our skin. This also helps with pores, skin rejuvenation. There is no downtime. Downtime might be a little bit of redness, um, they can have some swelling if you get close to the eyes. We're going to switch the goggles on her. But other than that, they can go on to their normal activities. So that's what's wonderful about it is people try to find how can I perform treatments on someone, on my clients, who do not want any downtime, right? So this is going to take a couple of treatments, but you are able to treat a lot of skin indications, even for darker skin types, right? So this is all skin types. And this gives you the modes and the parameters on how to treat those clients appropriately. For the fractional hand piece, we are going to do mode one. What that does is it also targets melasma and pigmentation at the same time. So we are gonna brighten up the skin without causing too much heat that irritates melasma. If you have any questions, we can help you with the information of darker skin types, lighter skin types, melasma. There are treatment protocols to utilize both hand pieces in one treatment. As you can see, it was really easy for me to switch it out. So you can do a lot with this device. 
We're gonna do two to three passes on her. It's gonna be a bright light. She should feel some warmth. There shouldn't be any stinging or any discomfort. Are you excited? Yeah. Woo, me too. You can hear some loud snapping. That could be a little intimidating, but it shouldn't be uncomfortable. You should feel some warmth. If it gets too hot, let me know, okay? This system, when I went ahead and pressed ready, one thing about this is it says check spot size. So it wants me to do an 18 millimeter. As you can see with the other hand piece, it's at a 20. So to change that, I'm gonna be right in the middle of an 18 to allow you to use the fractional hand piece. So you can change it right here on the spot size, but you also need to change it on the original hand piece itself that's not a fractional to be able to utilize the fractional. So that is important to know that you just have to change a couple of things to make it work. And it is for a safety for the device um, and for you to utilize the treatments appropriately. All right, here we go. How does that feel? It just feels warm. Feel the tissue heating up. I do want to do a little bit more down here. see some of the pigment lesions are starting to get darker. Okay, turn for me, I'm gonna get right here, okay. Your nose. What does it feel like? Honestly, it just feels warm. So it's comfortable? Yeah, totally comfortable. Do you want me to do your upper lip? Have you fold your upper lip over your teeth? Yep, just like that. Okay, here we go. That can be a little sensitive. different of a feeling isn't it yeah just it, it's honestly just kind of hot but in a <laughs> almost relaxing okay, I'm gonna get this side right here okay? okay I actually doesn't it feel like a hot stone massage it does it feels really nice yeah so I actually have this done and it's very comfortable can see the skin actually tighten. Does it feel tighter? Kind of, yeah. The warmth feels really nice. Here we go. 
Does that feel a little warm? Mm -mm. I just want to try this. Okay, let me know if it's too hot. Okay, there okay. we go. Is that too hot? It's a little hot, yeah. I don't, I don't. Tolerable? Yeah, tolerable for sure. Okay. I'm just gonna do one pass with this, okay? Okay. And you get right by your cheek here. Because that's where that melasma is. Shots on your nose, okay, here we go. At the end, the client was super happy. She did wonderful, she didn't have any discomfort. You got to see how the handpiece works for the 1064, 755, and hair removal. You also got to see the fractional handpiece for brightening, tightening, toning, resurfacing, even for melasma. This device does a lot. It also has great information, treatment settings, outcomes, and post-care, pre-care, what to do in a situation. So all of this is included with this device. If you have any questions, let us know, MRP. I'm Chesney, and I hope you enjoyed this.